Skillet! Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. What's your name, bro? Elijah. Ariel. Yeah, I'm Kiki. What's your What's your zodiac sign? Uh, Cancer. I'm a Leo. You're a Leo. Twins. Let's go. So today's question of day is: Do zodiac signs matter in a relationship? All right. So to me, no. Granted, I date someone right now who that's like a big part of why they choose people. Yeah. Um, but no, and if you and the person you're with or trying to get with, like, don't agree on, like, zodiac signs, you just need to, like, stand your ground, but in a joking way. Um, not at all. Not at all. Why? Elaborate. Because, like, zodiac sign doesn't, like, you know, tell you what your personality is or, like, anything. It's just, you will want. That's it. Not entirely. I do think that, like, sometimes, it, it determines the vibe between you and the other person, but it doesn't like, it doesn't really mean like whether or not the relationship is going to be successful. So since you're a cancer, uh -huh. I want to ask this, right? Yeah. Do you think zodiac signs matter in a relationship? Yeah. Okay. No. I feel like social media plays an influence to it though. You go on Twitter, you'll see, like I said, I don't know why, but you go on Twitter on TikTok and a girl, for example, it could be a guy too, um, but like a guy or a girl, you know, it'd be like, oh, you know the most uh, red flags of of a, you know can't, of, not a cancer sign but like a sign you know a zodiac sign uh, and who's like the best to be so who to date right and um, I don't know bro I really don't know. Do you think social media has any play at zodiac signs? Oh yeah, for sure. Cause there's there's like TikToks that like like whole like TikTok accounts that are like dedicated to like astrology stuff. I mean astrology. And then there's like Instagram pages that are like your zodiac sign as such and such. And so yeah, it's, it's definitely social media does play a big part. Okay. So how do you feel about people saying that oh like oh if you date a Capricorn, they're gonna they're gonna be toxic or something like that. If you date like a cancer, they're gonna be toxic. How do you feel about those things? Mm. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I, I partially do like lean into that a little bit, but I don't like let it dictate like whether or not I'm interested in a person. Um, but as for like other people, like, like I said, like I don't, I don't think it's really that big of a deal. Like, cause I, I feel like once you get to know the person, like their sign becomes like irrelevant. Okay, how did how did your sign become irrelevant as you know the person? Because they might be completely different than what like their zodiac sign traits are. So, because because a lot of a lot of people say that I don't give off Leo vibes, like when they first meet me, and I don't you know why. But how do you feel about Leos? If you're a Leo, you 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 Leo. I I don't even know like the full details and like signs, bro. I can say I just know my sign because you know that's who I am, and I, I read about it. But like descriptive of other signs and shit, I don't know. If you're a Leo, I'm cool. I'm cool with everybody, so. If you're a Leo, I'm cool with you. It doesn't matter if you're Pisces. If you're cool with me, I'm cool with you. Leos? Yeah. My little brother and my stepfather are both Leos. So, hey, they act completely different. It doesn't matter. I truly don't care. <laughs> this man is a good man. Hey, bro. What's up? Exactly. That has some power. You say, I have no idea about <laughs> zodiac signs. I just know the book. What month is that? Yeah. That's August. Yeah. August? That's like. Oh, what did I say about them? July and August. Wait, like the worst zodiac sign, something like that? Yeah. Or like, like, yeah, I, no. Because a lot of people speculate that people are like toxic. They have all this, you know, there's all, all these toxic traits that they can put on there. I don't know what happened. I, I know a lot of people that are going in. Yeah, late, late to my. Oh, I know a lot of people, but and they are really different. Mm -hmm. like, all of them, every single one of them, going that day, month, they all different. Cause like you can, it's just they're different people. Like some of them are being that toxic. It's just different. So I can like miss every one or just one. So like sign. 
what signs do you consider calm and what signs do you consider energetic? Um, definitely fire signs are energetic. Um, I would say, yeah, the fire signs and the earth signs are definitely more energetic and the like air and the water signs I think are on the calmer side, okay. in my experience. Okay, so in, I guess in your opinion, what signs would you consider toxic? A few Scorpios, not all Scorpios. Um, like um, maybe, mainly those two, mainly those two that I just can't really vibe with. Capricorns and Scorpios. Yeah. Looking around, making sure, because I don't know who might be listening in. Somebody might rush up on us. <laughs> I don't know. How do you feel about people that? push the narrative to saying that certain zodiac signs are compatible with this one. Like say, Leo's like compatible with Capricorn, mm -hmm. and Capricorn's compatible with uh, Gemini, something uh -huh. like that. How do you feel about that? Well, honestly, I think that, and I hate to be like blunt here, but that shit is bullshit to me. Like, it, I just feel like it's just energy. It's just, if you want to make it work, it's going to work out. If you want to make it work, another person want to make it work out, it's going to work out. It doesn't matter about your sign, your personality, blah, blah, blah. If the other person like you, and if you like that person, and y'all got the energy going, that 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 chemistry going, that's all it is. Energy. I don't give a fuck about. I don't think it matters about sign or nothing. That shit is just, you know what I'm saying? And I'm a person who believes in signs too. Like I believe in that shit a little bit. I don't go deep into it, but I believe it just a little bit. But like the the whole like you feel me? Oh, this sign is more compatible with this sign. It's just like it. No, no. Yeah. Yeah. Just no. 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 Yeah. No. No. <laughs> no. Okay, okay. Yeah, no. How do you feel about people that do base their relationships off of zodiac signs? Um, I feel um they're pretty I should have put something on topic. They I don't know how to put it because like you shouldn't you shouldn't at all. It's like that means your dating relationship will never last long. Because you put it based on something that someone made up. I also feel like the Zodiac sign, they just use like attributes of one person and it kind of um, place it on everybody else. So I don't think it's me, it's like, me and this. A lot of people were born the same day that you were born. That means like you all, all have the same personality. Does it doesn't make sense? Yeah. Like, it doesn't make sense. How do you feel about the people that base their relationships on Zodiac signs? Oh, well, that's like super dumb to me. It's always been super dumb, but hey. Yeah, I've seen people base their relationship standards off of like worse things. So it's just like it's just when you start to when it starts to permeate every single facet of your life is when you're like it's when I have to just like put a stop to it. Um, but if you're just like like to do birth charts or whatever, or you like to see like how it's gonna impact you, do you like you have that little app with like quotes that tell you based off of your zodiac, like tells you to quote your zodiac. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sit here and tell you not to do that. It's, it's your phone. It's your life. Do what you, do what you want. I feel like when I it, in certain uh, like instances, I feel like it's almost a defense mechanism. It's like you know, let's say um, a person believes in you know zodiac signs and goes deep into it, right? Mm -hmm. um, and she's like, oh, okay, I I talked to this zodiac sign before. This person is, is this zodiac sign before. Maybe that's not the best person for me. Like you, you feel me? Like I. I don't know if it makes sense, but it's like so. So what you're saying is they basically use a zodiac. They basically use zodiac signs to describe the person that they want to be. With. Yeah, and it's not. It's not. That's not how it is. Cause like, you know, like I can see someone on TikTok be like that. That describes a cancer of like what is what is the cancer supposed to be? Mm -hmm. And I'll be like, that's not me. Like, I think they're doing too much. Like it, it doesn't really matter that much. Really. Like it's it's not that deep. It's not that deep. How do you how do you how do you mean? Like in. Like, I mean, like, for me, like, zodiac signs are interesting, but I don't think, like, everything revolves around your zodiac sign. So, I don't, I don't hold that much importance to it. She gets it. It's some new age shit, bro. It's some new shit. New it's some 2022 shit. shit. Yeah, bro. And like I said, I'm a person, I'm a person who believes into it a little bit, but I'm not a person that's like, oh, that shit matters, or this person is this way because they were born on this time. Like, fuck no. Everybody is different. 
just because they're different. Right, girl, if you vibe with the person, you vibe with the person regardless. Fuck the Zodiac sign. Facts. facts. No bullshit. Hey, that's facts though. That's facts. <laughs> that's facts. <laughs> yeah.